Hi guys, welcome to this session in Microsoft Visio. In this module, I want to show you how you can get Excel data paste and linked into a Visio diagram. So first of all, I want to create a Visio diagram and I'm going to use a scheduling diagram and I've already got it open. So I'm just going to bring a timeline onto the screen. Gives you the date duration. I'm just going to leave all of this default. So click OK to that. So it gives me some dates. I'm going to right click and get myself a little arrow head at the end. I like that. And then I'm going to put some time phase items on there. So let's call this, that's a start date description. I'll call this phase one. Okay, so I want five phases. So I'm just going to bring on a few more. You can flick these back. So this will be phase two. You can flick these the other way up if they get too, if it gets too cluttered. I'm not going to change the duration. Just pick up this little yellow thing and move it down. Like that, and it flicks down. So do them alternate like that. So this will be phase three. And then what I'm going to do is pick up some data in Excel I've already created and just drop it in here. This will be phase four. Okay to that, bring that one down. Make it down, well not too far down actually because I've got to put the Excel spreadsheet there. And then the last phase can be that one, phase five. So what I want to do, what I want to demonstrate is that you can have data in Excel that can be linked into this. It's monitoring the cost of this project. So this is like an overarching project plan. So if I just bring um, an Excel spreadsheet up onto the screen, which I've got here, so you can see this, let's make this full screen. This is what I want to bring on to the Visio diagram. So this is my cost for this project as an ongoing costs. So if, let's say I haven't actually spent that yet, that would be blank. So I can just demonstrate this. I don't need a title. So there's my data in Excel. And if you don't want the actual totals on there, which can get a bit cluttered, you can just push that back that way a bit and it'll knock it off. Went a bit too far there, bring that back down again. So I'm getting the actual balances there. You can see the negatives. So I want the whole thing, all of this, the table and everything into Visio. So what I need to do is highlight it all like this, copy it, control C, get myself back into Visio. Now I don't want to paste it. I want to do paste special and paste link. So paste special, paste link is the key. So it updates and then click OK to that. Then it'll sit in Visio. I just need to move it down a little bit. So if I make this a bit smaller, this screen, it's not that small. Okay, come down a little bit. So that's sitting underneath the diagram in the, in the way a little bit. So if I come back across so I can get that in the middle and make it slightly bigger, can't make it too big. It goes off the screen, but there you go. So at the moment, there's no figures in there. Now, if I go back into Excel and add a figure in there, let's say we've got a cost there of 3334. So that's just added that in there. And then I come back into Visio. That's automatically put that in there. So you've got your timeline across the top and then you've got some real time data paste special and linked underneath the diagram. So you can see the impact of the costs of that timeline project. So hopefully that's a little video, this little video is okay of use to you. The fact that you can actually link data from Excel like that using Pay Special and Pay Link. So thank you for your time and I'll catch you on the next one.